What makes an insect an insect? For one thing, insects have special bodies. All insects have a hard shell on the outside called an exoskeleton. The shell protects the little insect just like metal armor protects a knight. Ladybug. Earwig. What body parts do insects have? Insect bodies have three parts a head, a middle section called a thorax, and an abdomen. These three parts are easy to see on one insect that everyone knows the ant. Head, thorax, abdomen. Ant, grasshopper. How many legs do insects have? People have two legs. Dogs and cats have four legs, and insects have six. But not all insect legs are the same. Some legs are good for jumping far, others are perfect for climbing, grabbing, running, or swimming. Did you know? Spiders have eight legs. They are not insects. Grasshopper. Praying mantis. How many wings do insects have? Most insects have two or four wings, and just like legs, there are different kinds of wings. Dragonflies' big wings are perfect for flying fast and making quick turns in midair. But beetles' wings are different. One pair is thick and leathery to protect the second pair of delicate flight wings. Dragonfly. Beetle. How many eyes do insects have? Most insects have two different types of eyes. Insects' simple eyes, called ocelli, can only sense light. Their larger compound eyes can see objects and animals and their movements. Did you know? Houseflies' compound eyes have thousands of little parts called lenses. Each lens sees a piece of a bigger picture. What would an apple look like to a fly? Fly. What are antennae? All insects have two feelers or antennae sticking out of their heads. They help insects touch, taste, and smell the world around them. Insect body parts hard outer shell called an exoskeleton, head, thorax, and abdomen, six legs. Usually two or four wings. Sometimes simple and or compound eyes. Two antennae. Antennae. Where do insects live? Everywhere. They fly through the air and walk on the ground. They dig in the dirt and hide under rocks. They climb through the trees and swim in water. Some insects even live in your home. Damselfly. Harlequin bug with eggs. Common stonefly. Water strider. Orange stonefly. Did you know? Some insects, like fleas, make themselves at home on other animals. Butterfly. Pallid winged grasshopper. Flea. B. Milkweed bug. Do insects live in groups? People live together in groups called families. Some insects live together in groups too. Ants, bees, and termites live in groups called colonies. Bees. Ants. Did you know? Termites eat wood from trees and your house. What are the different roles in insect groups? Each member of an insect group has a special job. Some find and gather food, some build and dig, others take care of the young. Insect habitats in the air, on the ground, in dirt, under rocks. In trees, in and around water, in colonies or hives.
Termites. What do insects eat? Some insects eat leaves and stems from plants and trees. Others suck nectar and juice from flowers and fruit. And some insects like to eat other insects. Did you know? Some insects drink blood from other animals, like you. Other insects, like cockroaches and flies, eat garbage, animal waste, and other dead things. But they recycle garbage to keep the earth clean. Butterfly, ladybug, aphids, ladybug larvae. Did you know? Silverfish like to eat paper. Keep them away from your books. Insect diets, plants. Other insects, blood, wood and paper, garbage, animal waste, and other dead things. Mosquito, fly, cockroach, silverfish. How do insects talk to each other? Ants communicate through smells. They use odors to warn their nestmates of danger and to lead them to food. Other insects send messages with movement. When a bee finds food, it will do a little dance in the nest to tell the other bees it's time to eat. Ants, bees. What other senses do insects use to communicate? Many insects communicate with sounds. Male field crickets chirp by rubbing their wings together to attract a female cricket. Fireflies. Find each other with flashes of light. Insect communications, smells and scents, motion, sound, light, fireflies, cricket. How do insects protect themselves? Wasps use poison stings to fight off predators. Other insects wear special armor. A few insects, like stink bugs, spray stinky liquids at their enemies. They are the skunks of the insect world. Wasp, goldsmith beetle. How do insects hide? Many insects have colors that blend in with the places they live. This is called camouflage. Can you find the camouflaged insects on this page? Insect defenses. Stingers, hard shell or exoskeleton, bad smell, color, stink bug, scarlet and green leaf hoppers, giant walking stick. How do insects grow up? All insects hatch from eggs. As they grow, they get bigger and begin to look more like their parents. Just like you, the change that insects go through from egg to adult is called metamorphosis, which means changes shape. Egg, larva, caterpillar. Is metamorphosis the same for all insects? There are different kinds of metamorphosis. Some insects change by just growing bigger. Others grow wings, but there are some insects, such as butterflies. That change so much that the adult looks nothing like the youth. Insect life cycles. All hatch from eggs. All go through metamorphosis. Pupa, chrysalis. Adult. Did you know? Flies can taste with their feet. Mosquitoes beat their wings seven hundred and twenty times in a single second when in flight. Fleas can jump two hundred times their own length. Water striders can actually walk on water. Ladybugs can lay one thousand eggs in their lifetime. Cockroaches are so smart that they have learned to run mazes in laboratories. Giant water bugs have been known to eat tadpoles and small fish. Some beehives have more than fifty thousand bees.
Dragonflies can fly as fast as 35 miles, 56 kilometers per hour. Crickets' ears are on their legs. Insects are amazing. And there is still so much to learn about them. In 2022, biologists identified a new type of gall wasp called Neuroteris valhalla, spotted on the branches of a huge oak tree on the campus of Rice University. It is just a millimeter long. Who knows what other creatures are crawling around? The only way to find out is to grab a magnifying glass and look.